Oh, that was so dumb. I can't believe that I, uh, <laughs> I chose an IP address that's already in use in my network, but gives us another learning opportunity. Uh, 172.20.0100 is the IP address I chose, which something else is using. I don't even know what it is. I'm going to do uh, nano, which is a text editor, forward slash uh, etc, forward slash network, forward slash interfaces, and hit the enter key. This is where the, the IP address configuration for Proxmox is contained. I'm going to go in here and change this from 172.20.0100 over to 172.20.0.50. Do a control X on the keyboard. It says, do you want to save your buffer? Yes, I do. Hit the enter key. Then, sorry, this is uh, probably going off the bottom of the screen here for you. Uh, at the bottom, once you change the IP address, you just have to use IF down to turn off the interface. Once you change the IP address by editing that file, you just use IF down and we'll do VMBR0 as the interface. Once you change the IP address, you could cycle the interface or I'll just do the uh, lazy way. I'll do a shutdown dash R now, which tells the server to reboot. And by the time it comes back up, we should have this thing running on a brand new IP address. <laughs> 